Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to BTE TV. We're here having an absolutely fabulous time. I have Patrick here, who is a designer in his own right. He also works with Zhang Toy as the uh, publicist and PR person, and he just does an amazing job at Fashion Week. I wear many hats. You wear many hats, not only just many hats at Fashion Week, but you're a designer in your own right. These are the shirts that Zhang Toy wears. Talk about these fabulous shirts. Yeah, well, one of the things that I, you know, I don't consider myself a designer by trade. I think that, you know, when I started this t-shirt company, I, I started it because I had trouble finding t-shirts that fit me well and that were comfortable. So I started making my own t-shirts. And uh, I had friends, including Zhang, who wore t-shirts regularly. Zhang, for 30 years, has worn a, a black Calvin Klein t-shirt. So I took one of those t-shirts and I, and, I, and I made it. I made him a bamboo t-shirt, which is made of 100% bamboo fabric, all of my shirts, uh, which is softer than cotton, uh, eco-friendly, organic, natural and uh, it's naturally antibacterial so it's 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 really has really great properties um, and I made them very fitted so I made one for Zhang he loved it so now it's become his staple in his wardrobe uh, uh, and he wears it all the time with his his mini kilt so um, the, and it, more and more people through Zhang and through friends you know wanted the shirts so I started producing a whole line with multiple styles uh, I started doing uh, like here we have like a women's women's v-neck which is one of my most popular sellers. Uh, I cut them very long because I find that I get a lot of uh, ladies that like that buy them just to sleep in them because they're so comfortable. <laughs> it's like, yeah. yeah, but you or can, they could wear with boots. <laughs> yep, and but it's, so so the fabric is you know it's dressy enough that you can wear it out. You know it's uh, um, it's very uh, luxurious fabric, but it's still so comfortable. So I think that the the bamboo. As a as a as a fabric is really the next thing, you know. It's really the next place that, and and like I said, I'm not a designer by trade, but I find that you know, making T-shirts is almost more of a science, mm -hmm. you know, because it's about trying it's about trying to get the right fit, the right fabric, you know, make sure that it, that it holds up, that it's sturdy, that it washes well, that it's comfortable, and making sure that all of those things go into one T-shirt becomes, you, you know, what Zhang does is is so different than than you know what I'm going for you know so that's why we our t our two worlds kind of work together mm -hmm. because you know Zang, Zang is Zang is very much so an artist and what I consider you know making a t-shirt it's it's you know I, d I could never I can't even imagine doing what Zang does but <laughs> this I can handle <laughs> but you know what it's you know even though it's a t-shirt it's a design it's a work of art you thought of doing it with bamboo which I think is very important because like you said it helps save the world it's eco-friendly all these things comfortable to sleep in are you kidding this yes. is absolutely amazing so it's important that the things that you do have I mean look I mean even well, though Zhang does this you do that it's, it's amazing together right one of the things about bamboo that I'll mention is that it's it's uh, one of the most sustainable crops uh, available it grows so quickly it grows two inches an hour it requires no pesticides, fertilizers. So for the environment, in comparison to cotton, mm -hmm. which is one of the largest contributors to volatile organic compounds, it's very damaging for, uh, and it erodes, erodes the soils, it gets into the water, it gets, you know, from all those fertilizers and pesticides. Bamboo requires nothing, requires, it grows on its own, it naturally resists um, uh, bacteria, so it requires no pesticides, no fertilizers, and it's softer than, softer than cotton. So I think it's really the next fabric for t-shirts so i'm excited to uh to start start a bamboo line well it looks great and the wonderful thing i like is the colors are so amazing yes yeah, so we're going to get a look at the colors some beautiful deep purple nice yellows i mean just colors you just can't resist but wear and the thing also is the beautiful long ones you made for ladies yes. i think that that's amazing very nice yes i just started the purple actually the pur uh the the purple color is my my latest, and and the reds. Um, I I think that the the deep uh, bold colors are kind of uh, w the trend right now. That people are people are gravitating towards stronger colors, making a bigger statement um, with their t-shirts. But yet I still keep. You know, I still keep true with the basic black. And, and now, Patrick, so your T-shirts are so amazing. I love the colors, everything eco-friendly. But, of course, people are going to want to know, where can I get one of these T-shirts? Website, email, phone number, boutique? Uh, well, you know, I've just started. I'm going to be carrying them in my first boutique, which is going to be downtown in the Meatpacking District in Manhattan, uh, DDC Lab. Um, I also sell them online. At, oh, uh, my website is thebambooshirt.com, um, www.bambooshirt.com. T-H-E, bamboo shirt.com. 
Um, and uh, that that's it right now. You know, th through Zhang, you know, I've, I've made a lot of connections and contacts that I'm selling them through, but I'm excited to see what the possibilities are in the future. Well, there are going to be quite a bit of possibilities, and we're going to be right back in just a moment.